This is breaking news. Cows on the loose tonight. Highway 50 shut down. Big rigs jackknife near Camino. Good evening. Thanks for joining us. I'm Curtis May. And I'm Adrienne Moore. CBS 13's Marissa Perlman is live on the scene with the very latest. Marissa. Well, guys, can't believe this happened the night before Thanksgiving. We know the cows, thankfully, are safe, but what a big mess to talk about this evening. We know it was a big crash, a big backup, at least three trucks involved, one of those carrying at least 82 cars. Cows, rather. Five of them we know got loose. We just saw them a few moments ago um, being corralled here. They're safely in this pen right here. Okay, corral helping things happen tonight. All of this happening right in the middle of the 50, which, by the way, is closed down in both directions and should be closed down for the next couple of hours as well. This happening uh, just outside of downtown Placerville. You can hear some of the, uh, the cows here behind us. Obviously shaken and upset by what happened. Lots of first responders here on the 50 trying to clean up this mess and get the traffic moving in both directions. Again, right now we know that all of the cows have been accounted for. One of them was headed for downtown Placerville. That one's still on the loose tonight, but we'll keep you posted as to when 50 will be back open this night. To so tonight we to have traffic, guys. one cow on the loose. And what have they? They've literally set up a pen there right on Highway 50, corralling all these cows? Yeah, this is, it's kind of an amazing story to hear all of these local farmers coming together. Uh, once that these local farmers heard this was happening, they immediately jumped into action. OK, Corral, a local uh, farming uh, company here, set up a, a pen and had some of these uh, cows kind of corralled here to make sure that they're safe right off of the, uh, the highway here. And again, we're kind of in the middle of all this action. We're being asked to, to move here right now because I think they're trying to get things wrapped up as quickly as possible and get cars moving in both directions as soon as possible. Here we see crews kind of uh, getting all of the cows still in the silver truck right here into, uh, into the, the pen behind us. All right, a wild scene there. All right, Marissa, thanks. And now let's show you the power of this bomb cyclone.